I tell you, I kind of like that Shadow Fiend if it's not too bad of a matchup. So, a lot of AoE now. So, it is on the earlier end, but it, just between Jakiro, Nyx Assassin, and Puck, the AoE spells they're going to be tossing out should give plenty more space to this Lone Druid, I would say, than their previous game. And, ah, always relevant. <laughs> I got this thing here. <laughs> Very curious to see how this works out. And of course, getting this kind of interesting placed ward here, it's going to see any movement that will be off the side. I guess, is it going to see that pole camp that we've been seeing all the Radiant side? It doesn't look like it. I, it would be tough for them to make that happen. But Matumbo Man, going to need to dodge away from all of this. Impale is going to connect. Looks like they will be able to take away that rune. And also, Matumbo Man getting ran down. He might end up going down trying to make it to the shrine. And he is going to be able to get there. But is it? I think that he's just going to waste the shrine and end up dying nonetheless. The second Impale, Matumbo Man dropping. And first blood. Um, I'm not sure exactly how you recover with this, especially since you need to make sure that your Venge is having an okay time. So, I mean, it's fine, though. Like, Sansa, he can't be here the entire time. Puck misses out on a lot of those advantages in the mid lane against Alchemist because you can't use phase shift at oh. all. It gives you no extra survivability against this hero. Bottom lane again. Matumba in trouble, trying to find the kill. Dual Breath is going to connect, and that should be enough. Another kill going their way, and, and Puppy. Oh, GH might get the bear up top. Uh, looking for it, but meanwhile, over here on the other side, they found Miracle walking up into high ground is in a lot of trouble as well, and he is going to pop. So 3 0 start already, secret on a roll, despite the troubles that are going on up in the top lane. I will say, how many times have we seen Alchemists just end up having a really rough laning stage and then come back, though? He, he is in some trouble now, not quite level 6, and so he's going to have to bottle through this. No TP either. Going to try and deny himself to some Ancients, and is it going to come in time? No. Mid one ends up picking up that kill. It still means that if they try and defend up top, mind controls here with the split. So it's a very diff difficult proposition here for the Dire. Even oh. this TP. Uh, mid one going for it in maybe a little bit of trouble. They get the silence off, but still need to be chased around. He does not have a blink right now. Can Kuroki find him? He has a fire blast there and ends up being able to phase shift, get out of there for the moment with the jaunt. Kuroki getting ran down. They've gotten everybody in. They made enough space with mid one and Kuroki ends up going down, but they have used the split. There's the lift up onto the puck. They bring him back down, trying to find the kill. They are not going to be able to get it. He gets the jaunt out at the end. And now Matumba Man also in trouble. They are going to throw out the Savage Road, but it's not going to be enough. Still trying to chase mid one down. Can they get this kill? No, the split is going to wear off. And mid one now looking for the silence, able to jaunt away again, just trying to outplay mind control here. Oh, and now mind control in a ton of trouble. They don't have another savage roar here, but they will, ah, they won't be able to get him. So mind control survives. Oh man, and Matumbo man here. Yeah, this is gonna be a tough one. I, I think that they're just committed to making his life hell as he's gonna walk back into the impale, the dream coil down, damage being dealt out and no way to escape. Tom just comes up, Mind Control's here, and they're not willing to engage into it. He's just hoping to find probably Coddle, I guess, rotating up or seeing if they were going to amass units in the top lane. Oh, oh. God. Kuroki, super dead. Arcane's Midas, 13 minutes. 900 gold as well. Swap out, looking for Puppy. They are going to be able to find that kill. Silence on to two, not bad. Ice Path the Macro Pyre. That was a pretty slick move right there by Matumbo Man. Pings come out. They realize that the movement is there from Keizu as well as mid one. Getting squared up for a fight. They pull back in Pile I Die, trying to find the kill. They don't have Global right now. Puppy had already blown it in the previous engagement, and he almost has it. Very, very close as they're smoked up together. DD Rune on the puck. They ping it out, though. Yes. Envision? Looks like it was. Yeah, that they ward have, they spotted have a ward, it. So. Yeah, Everybody nice backing call. out. Yeah, they're super ready for this. And Miracle is about to have Radiance at 16 minutes, despite his early woes. And meanwhile, over here to the side, they're going to drop the global down. Mind Control gain chase. Not dead as of yet, though, and he can get the split off now. GH still in trouble, but Puppy is the one who's going to end up falling now. A really good macro pyre down as well as the Ice Path. And Pilot Eye trying to get up to the high ground wasn't going to happen. The four staff was not quite quick enough. Liquid coming back strong off of this one, and well... The way this game is turning is Miracle starts turning in towards Tier 1. Yeah. Mind Control can help beat it down. Jakiro coming in a little bit close. This is a pretty bold move right now. Going to force Staff away, trying to, I guess, juke away from the stun there. Throws out the Ice Path. Not going to hit him. And the long duration they weren't able to hit him. 
Um, this is looking like it could go kind of south now for Liquid, trying to run away. Impale is not going to connect onto anybody, but they do have the jump in. There's mid one on top of Miracle, trying to bring them low. He is so freaking tanky, though. They're missing hits. He runs in the ice path. Macro Pyre down oh, as no, well. He's he he going to end up going down. Oh, it I, I, I feel like I must have missed something there with the way that fight started, because that looked very clunky. What was the Impale at? Did you see? I'm not sure. It might have been... I don't know. Yeah, he, I saw him get the carapace to stun the Alk, but then the ca I just saw Impale was on cooldown. So yeah. <laughs> it's like, oh, okay. Well, yeah. The dives anyway from my control down the bottom lane. Oh, going to be able to run down Keizu here. The Impale is out, but he had already run away the Earth Panda, so mind control going to be fine. Really good play from Liquid. Mind control. Courier. Nice. Oh, we'll the play. crit. Uh, both couriers go down <laughs> meanwhile across the board. They're able to take another one and drown running down and killing off Kuroki. Pile dies in the area and actually he's going to TP back home so they won't be able to get here in time to defend it. And mid one actually is going to be the person that they find going oh. over to try and get a rune. Face just, but he couldn't Yules. actually get it. Well, Yule Scepter lift up as well. He does have a blink. Oh, broken again. He's in a lot of trouble here, and he is going to be able to make it out for the moment. Oh, but the swap, swap trying to get out of there. They are not going to be able to quite catch up. One. Oh, that was so sick. Houdini <laughs> himself. Ran after the swap. He got the shot. That was so sick. Oh, all right. Close one, you know. Collar a little bit there, but it's all right. Shrine up. Now, the only thing is... They pop global and they still have split. So Roche still isn't free for the side of secret. Right. Poppy trying not to be a free kill here. Uh, well, they just use it right now and trying to run him down. They might be able to make it happen. They're trying to kill off the pandas instead. And no, the rest of the side of Liquid is actually not with them currently. So this is actually one of those moments where he might even want to let the panda live so that, that way yeah. when he comes back all right there they go nicely done they're going to be able to do it matumbo man swaps him out and he is still going to go down here i believe the rundown coming and matumbo man trying to run it as well see if he can find a kill this is actually a pretty bad fight unless they can kill off the alchemist and he can bring him in keizu trying to run away he's gonna pop the spike carapace throws out the impale as well running out and away from the alchemist illusions mid one trying to kill them off over on the other side of the fight they weren't able to quite kill off the Oh, Matumba man, Puppy is going to drop there. So they find that kill. 7 to 13. And. A little oh, bit mid of a one wants there. a backstab here. Jump. GH looking for it. Almost got him. Is he going to be able to find He's so low. He actually is going to re aggro the Arcane Curse, though. And that should be the kill onto the GH Coddle. Can they run down? Mid one yet again. He's going to be able to blink out for the moment. Still dealing damage. Jaunt away. Slippery little puck is going to be able to make his escape yet again. Well, maybe they pop Manta style illusions and send them over there to the shrine, but whatever the case is going to be, Secret do not want to give this up. They have Global for this fight as well. They actually had Ags on Coddle, and he wasn't going to be able to get off the hill right at the start. Global Silence comes out. Everybody taking a lot of damage right now. The Lyrical is going to end up stunning himself. Also, Mind Control tried to keep them back, but it just couldn't happen. Gold going the way of Secret, and now they spot out GH on the high ground as well. Mid one blinks up there. Going to be able to take him down. Three dead already. Keizu looking for more. Kuroki is going to end up dropping as well, so... Oh man, Secret came back in a big way in this fight, and now they're going to be able to turn their sights onto Roshan, and that is a huge win for them. It, GH maybe been able to get off one more blind, or rather, uh, Illuminate, as he is going to end up dropping now. Um, they might have been able to keep the Alchemist alive, and that's one of those fights where if you, you're able to save him at the last second, that was a little unfortunate right there. GH actually had recalled Miracle, but uh, Miracle got hit by the Macro Pyre, and so it canceled. So he wasn't able to show up for that one. And now everybody joining as well. MP already bringing Miracle fairly low. Pops BKB turns to fight. There is going to be the stun coming out as well. Mind Control tried to go for the split, but is still silenced. I think that they're going to be okay through this, though. They've found MP starting to bring him low. They get caught. A really good ice path. Going to connect on to three in the follow-up there. Mind Control trying to control up MP, and it looks like they are going to be able to do it. He ends up going down. Matumba Man also in trouble, though, as Puppy is turning and fighting and damage coming in. He is going to end up dropping just barely now oh mid one as well as pile i die left completely alone i think that mid one is going to get out of there but everybody else they're thinking about going back for the sheep stick himself he could still build this into a lincoln's if you want sometimes you see that on pucks obviously but 
Roshan gonna fall. They're getting into position to fight it, though. GH is there. They have Blinding Light if they want to use it from far away. Global already comes out, though, and Miracle pops his BKB, turns to fight, wants to battle into these guys. They're all still silenced up, and Split is available. Jump in. Another nice Ice Path. Gonna control him. Puppy, the only one left in the Roche pit, and they are already able to take down MP. There's a huge fight for them. Yet again, Liquid looking good, and they have the Ags out from Keizu, but he had to blink away and get out of there. So Roshan, out of mana. so low. He's going to end up getting stunned up by the Alchemist stun, and they find the kill. Oh, and Liquid looking quite strong now. Everything online for him, and this Aegis, they are ready to make this play happen. Pylite going to walk right into it. They spot him out, and very scary moment indeed. Matumba Man is there, but Kezu is as well. They popped the BKB, so he is going to be able to stay alive through this for the moment. At least Bear is on top of him. Alchemist chasing now, able to find Puppy, but he's already used Global, and it looks like over to the side here, mid one when a decent amount of damage they have already taken down my control though and now mp is he gonna go down they do find that kill double for miracle pile i die also to fall three down and no buyback on two of them it looks like they're also gonna be able to maybe take kezu and mid one or way the hell over in the corner of the map please just don't come after me waiting for the macro pyre to wear off now mp still pushing you can just show how much respect liquid have right now for secret they are not willing to walk up this high ground and Fear of this stuff happening and dodging back away from the impale. They know where Nyx is from that impale, I'm pinging him out. Yeah. Well, stun there. Well, a lot of damage being dealt there. Gonna force staff him for Matumba Man able to pull back out Miracle. So he is gonna take a ton Has of damage cheese? from this one and able to eat it up. So still alive. Keizu tries to jump away. They get the sheep off. Mana leak as well. They swap him back in again. Matumba Man wants this. The stun does come out on Akuro himself, though. But Keizu gone in an instant. Oh, man. Miracle is too freaking big. And Puppy going to get pounded in the head. Miracle trying to get that kill. Wasn't quite online. and needs to go to the shrine to stay alive. It is going to help. And a secondary wow. shrine. He's still alive for the moment. They are trying to make this work. It's, well, Miracle gets sheeped up. They're controlling him for the moment. And MP is starting to get the hits off. This might be enough here. If they could somehow manage to bring him, it would be absolutely huge. The right click still going. All of the racks are gone in this bottom lane, but the blade mail turn around oh, and there mind it is. control. MP goes down. My control making the plays and the swap back in with the illusion from the Venge. There goes Pylite die as well. They're all going to end up dying here. Liquid with the plays. And my control still has the Aegis. They don't give a damn. Oh, they're going to swap back in again. The Matumba Man illusion doing the work in this fight. He is finally going to drop there as mid one also going to take the damage global silence comes out and well this is the ice path they're trying to keep them back as desperately as they can my control chasing down puppy they need 14 seconds until lone druid is back up and this is going to be a stun for miracle he's going to hit himself here but silencer tp'ing in or staffed out Looks like they want to try and escape. They don't want to chase this one down too much. And mid one, they catch him with three. Okay, nice dream coil down there as well. He has the sheep six hill, but he ends up getting sheeped himself. Be trying to do the damage, swapping again. Mid one in trouble. MP is doing the damage in the back lines. They take down mind control, and there's the impale and a miracle. They might be able to bring him down here. This is a huge kill for them. A thousand gold into the coffers of MP. I don't know if it's still going to be enough here. His own concoction, Lotus Orb, back to him to stun him in place for the impale. GH dropping. They find that kill as well. Oh, that's going to be two, three down. Question three is something. like, can you stop yourself from getting stunned into a way that when he buys back, you're not just immediately dead on MP? Right. So he goes down. Oh, God. They queue up the sheep stick as well, but Echo Shell going to take it off. Now turning onto the back of them again. One is here, but it was a long lift up. Oh man, it's 20 Can't more do. seconds, it's like, I, like, is it worth forcing Alex buyback for me to use my own here? This is pretty rough. They really want it, but I don't think they're going to get it. Ow. And now they need to be very careful about how they back out. Oh, good swap, mid one into another sheep, and... Nyx, have a nice stun. Able to catch on to two with that one. Ice path on to three, okay, that's a decent way to start. Miracle actually dropping pretty low, but Matumba Man again, always there for his buddy. MP running away, mind control chasing as well. Keizu is going to be able to hit another stun here, and well, the Impale also connect. Global Silence comes out. They just don't have the damage as of yet on the Miracle to bring him down. He pops his BKB, turns to fight. That's going to be another kill going their way. Stun now going to come out. Puppy in trouble. MP in trouble. A huge Impale, but it's all for naught.
buyback on the lone druid. Maybe it's not all for naught. I got split in five okay. seconds. Yeah, Miracle. He's needing to run out of here. They throw out the Lotus Orb onto him, getting slowed by the Scotty, and, well, another huge impale coming out. Keizu making the plays for him. Can they do this secret? Oh, desperately hanging on, but MP, he ends up going down 60 seconds without him, and it was just all too much for them. The life steal, the spell steal, and now the tower's fallen. Liquid take game number one. Wow. Impressive laning stage coming out from Secret. Seemed like they had a pretty good edge. Carry themselves into that mid game. But Liquid really danced around there. Getting Miracle up to that Radiance. A couple nice counter kills. What was it, like 8 nothing at one point? Yeah. And things were looking all Secret. But Mind Control 